What's up guys, it's your boy Wayby. In today's video, I'm gonna be showing us how to fix your R3 stick drift when you're aiming. You know, aiming's really important and stuff. Um, more than anything, you don't wanna have stick drift on the controller. What I recommend is getting a DualSense PS5 controller. That's the one I used, I recommend. You can even get control freaks like at GameStop or something like that to put on your right stick too to help your aim and stuff like that. You guys can try to do movements to counteract the stick drift, such as like tapping around all the way around like this, holding down for 30 seconds each point, especially on like the black portion too. Um, like underneath so like you hold like hold it press that around spin it around and stuff try to and help the stick drift if it's like if it's drifting to the right you want to do things to make it go left so like holding it to the left and stuff like that but what i highly recommend on black ops 6 under controller is if you go to good settings controller go down to dead zones and dead zone input test the dead zone input and you see i still have a little bit but it's not too bad you basically just flick it around see if you have any stick drift and then increase the minimum until you don't have stick drift anymore um, you don't want to make it too high where it's like you have to really press it's going to mess your aim up i would do about a five but again if it still have some even if it's a little bit i mean i'll still do five but you can still change it to whatever you want so yeah that's how you guys can do it in black ops 6 hope you guys enjoy this video and i'm out peace